I want to crimp my hair. I want to go full on groovy chick, bang on the door, bubblegum cards, Tamagotchi wearing crimped hair. It's also very satisfying. Oh, I'm so excited. Hi, welcome back to Beauty Lab at Home, where we've been testing out the latest skincare, hair care, and makeup. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any of our videos. This week, get ready to take it back with some serious 90s nostalgia because we are testing a crimper. Ah! This is the Tony and Guy Secret Ooh, Volumizing Crimper. It's got three different heat settings um, and you can use it to crimp just under your roots at the top layer of your hair to bring hidden volume and give your hair an instant boost or you can use it all over to create a dramatic crimped style. So this is ceramic, so that's good, so it's not going to make your hair frizzy. Um, it's a 25mm crimping plate and it's adjustable temperature. Oh, this is cool. It says pick the ideal temperature setting based on your hair wash cycle. So you've got wash day, second day, third day. That's really cool because I'm guessing it has the highest temperature on your wash day when your hair is needs more heat and then by the third day when it's greasy enough to um, hold itself. So I think I'm going to try it as a volumizing trick. So underneath the top layer of my hair, I'm just going to crimp some of the roots and see if that gives a volume boost. So I'm going to go with the secret volume aspect of this and do two bits underneath and see if it makes my straight style look more voluminous, if that makes sense. So I'm not looking to show the crimping, as great as it'll be, I'm looking to create some volume, kind of to make my hair more triangular, if anything. So we'll see how that works. Wish me luck. So I know that the idea of this being a secret crimper, ah, oh, just pinch this. <laughs> I want to crimp my hair. I want to go full on groovy chick, bang on the door, bubblegum cards, Tamagotchi wearing crimped hair. And I want to try and recreate Britney at the VMAs. You know, she had that black dress on and she had um, like her hair was wavy and then she had crimp sections. I'm telling you it's back because Kim, um, Kim K the other day also had crimped hair. So I just want to crimp bits, sections of my hair, okay? Okay, don't be mad at me. So I'm so, I'm so excited to crimp my hair. I don't even know how I'm meant to know when it's ready. I'm just gonna guess it is because it's been like a minute. Right. Let's just crimp a little bit here to start with underneath my hair. Oh, I'm so excited. How, how long do you hold a crimper? Oh my God, look at that crimp. Can you see it? It's kind of given a little bit of a lift already. It's working. I think it is. Oh my god, this is iconic. Okay. <laughs> no, the thing is, you need to see the full effect. Oh my god, my hair feels so weird. So I guess it's just like a slight bit of texture that the root is supposed to make the hair appear wider and then when your the top of your hair like lies over it it should have a bit of a volume boost from that crimped section so for that look for my britney look she did just have random sections right yay that was a britney impression by the way yay i would sing but um my voice is so good that i'm sure we'll get copyrighted <laughs> it works it works really well it's properly crimped my hair. Up close, you're a bit like, what has she done? Far away though. Cool. I can't tell you what it feels like. It feels mad. Okay. I mean, that definitely has added width there when you look at this side, which is seen for flat. This side looks a bit thicker already. Let's try and do this side as well. It's also very satisfying. Oh, that one's perfect. Look at that. I think it's kind of cool. I, th I think I've done this one too high. Oh, I have regret about that one. N not regret about anything else though. Should I crimp a tiny bit of my fringe? Oh, 
Right, I think I'm gonna do those two sections and now I'm gonna take this down and brush through and see if it creates volume. So I think there needs to be some method with my madness. But, hang on. Oh my God, adorable. It has a little bit actually. Just keep crimping. I can properly feel the sections that have been crimped. I love that I just said I need to have some method to my madness and my next line was just keep crimping. Yeah, it certainly does make it look a little bit thicker. Look at my little crimpy fringe. Bearing in mind I did those two tiny sections, that's even proper volume. Like, yeah. Okay, so I did a slightly bigger section there. Let's flip that hair, straight hair back over it. Yeah, that's definitely made a difference, hasn't it? Or am I dreaming? Mm, yeah. I think that did it again. Final thoughts are that this isn't something that I am gonna probably ever need. Just as a black woman whose hair is already natural and has volume to it. But I can see if your hair is straight naturally like I've straightened mine today, it does help create volume on, on the underneath. If volumizing sprays don't work for you, maybe this is maybe this is the vibe guys. Maybe that's what you need to be using it for. Not as a crimper to create crimped hair looks, but as a secret volumizer, like the packaging says. And I do think it has made my hair look thicker, um, particularly this side. <laughs> um, so yeah, I mean, it, 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 does, it does work in my opinion. The crimper is 39.99. So it's kind of mid price point. It's not super cheap, but it's not expensive. Um, and if you are like really after something that volumizes, I mean, this will do that. Not bad. <laughs> Overall, not bad. I think it's really cool. I think if I actually tried a bit harder, if I look down here, there. I think if I had my Britney picture to hand as I did it and tried a bit more, actually put some effort in, I actually would definitely wear this out. I kind of love it, um, but let me know if you think I've just committed an abomination to beauty, but I kind of love it. Thanks so much for watching Beauty Lab at home. We'll see you in the next one.